What's going on guys? Thanks for stopping by. Hope everyone's having a great day. This is Josh here as always with VHU here in Far Cry 4 to take a look at what is in my opinion the best gun, the best sniper rifle in the game. This is the AMR. Now some of you guys are going to disagree with me and I'll show you why very soon. This gun is a beast. This gun you unlock after liberating a whole bunch of outposts. I don't know. I don't have an exact number. And then you can purchase it at the trader for $390,000. Very expensive. I believe it's the most expensive gun in the game. This gun is a special weapon that does have a does have a scope on it, nice high power scope. You can zoom in nice and far on these little monkeys. You can zoom very far. Definitely one of the best zooming scopes in the game. It is nice and illuminated, so it makes it nice and easy to use at night. This gun does not have a suppressor, and that's kind of why people are going to hate on this gun. Here at the trader, you guys can see what exactly makes this gun so strong. This is the AMR here. Accuracy, damage, and range are maxed out fully. This gun is a bolt-action sniper, so the fire rate is lower, and mobility is about right in the middle. It does use cartridges, so it doesn't use any sort of uh, magazines or anything like that. It uses cartridges. The cartridges reload fairly quickly, probably four or five seconds or so. So in a firefight, you know, you're definitely going to want to not use this gun, but it, it's pretty fast for a sniper rifle. Not too bad at all. Compare that to the Predator, the damage is a little bit lower, accuracy and range as well. Fire rate and mobility are the same. They are both bolt-action snipers. But the thing is that the Predator has a suppressor on it, so you may find that advantageous, and I would definitely understand absolutely why you would. The M700 is very similar to the Predator as well. With a scope and suppressor on it, your accuracy is a little higher, damage is lower, range is uh, right about the same. Fire rate and mobility are around the same as well. So you're going to want to pick your pick your weapon here. Um, the Predator, the advantage obviously is that it has a suppressor. The AMR is just all about power. You better be prepared to hide when you fire the AMR if you don't take out everyone in sight. Otherwise, they're going to find you really quickly. Whereas with the suppressor, you're going to be able to be a little bit stealthier. Not necessarily have to kind of duck or uh, hit and uh, run there. You won't have to really hit and run and, and hide right away. So we're going to find uh, something here so I can show you just how strong this gun is. Okay guys, just to give you guys an example of just how strong this is, combat for me is very hard to come by because I have liberated all the outposts and the game is almost beat, so there's not much enemies around. This is a Rhino. Anyone who's played this game knows exactly how strong these Rhinos are. Now, it, it takes, even on the easiest difficulty, it takes a few minutes sometimes to kill these guys. Just to give an example here, I'm going to go ahead and shoot this Rhino right in the head with the AMR. And you can see it's a one-shot kill. And I'm playing on medium difficulty, so it's not like this is something that it's, I'm playing on easy where it's just easy. Anyway, even on the easiest difficulty, rhinos take a few minutes. Lots of grenades and firepower to take down. So it's definitely not just the uh, difficulty at all. So I hope that gives you guys an example of just how strong this gun is. Like I said, it's an absolute beast. Anything is going to be taken out in one shot as a proven right there. Now, the disadvantage, obviously, is it's not suppressed, like I said earlier. So you're going to have to decide if that's what you want or not. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video otherwise, and please feel free to leave comments in, down below and subscribe if you are new. Other than that, hope you guys have a wonderful day. Peace.